Krista Keniston, she's out in Mount Charleston. Looks like you're enjoying it. Tell us how it's looking out there. Well, it's looking like snow. We've been seeing snow showers like this on and off throughout the day. When we were driving up, like you just said, we saw snow as low as 6,000 feet. Now, I want to show you guys how much snow has fallen just in the past couple hours. You can see on this sign, clearly there's a couple inches. Again, this is just in the past couple hours. And officials at Lee Canyon say the snow was good timing. They brought out their snowmakers for the first time last night. And on top of that, they saw nearly two inches of fresh fresh accumulation overnight. They say they're hoping with this year's El Nino they'll see more snowfall and have a longer season than they've seen the past couple years. Last year we opened around December 13th, I want to say, and I mean we're looking to definitely beat that and, and hopefully hopefully make it into a November opening. Lee Canyon officials say they'll announce on social media when they plan to open officially for the season. Reporting live in Lee Canyon, Marissa Keniston, Channel 13 Action News. Winter Wonderland. Doesn't there. that look nice? Uh, you hear the oohs and the ahs from the set right there. And with an, an El Nino ear and a strong one at that, or very soon to be a strong one, more storms on the way for the winter. So that'll be interesting. But for tonight, with uh, temperatures in the 60s, I think you can only imagine how low the temperatures will drop. I'll have all the details coming up on those. All right, Brian, thank you.